Taya. And Nikita. And today we are back with another reaction video. Today's video is going to be scariest Snapchats ever from Shane Dawson. Let's just hop right into this video. Hey, what's up, guys? Yes, welcome back to another creepy video. He says, Snapchat. One of the most popular apps in the world. An estimated 158 million users a day. It's inevitable Damn. that with that many people making that snaps, some creepy ones might get through. And today we're going to be talking about some snaps that should have never been sent. From embarrassing yeah. moments to freak accidents, even death. What today is this scary or creepy? Oh my god, this is scary. Oh yeah, she can't sleep at night after she watched scary stuff. Sad and disturbing, but a scary little lighter. Now, some of you guys might remember this. I had never seen it. A few years ago, a woman snapped herself saving a turtle. Ooh. Or so she thought. So here's a little note to self. If anyone runs into a turtle, save it. Don't just leave it on the road. Now, the idea of saving a turtle is a good one. This did not turn out that way. Oh turtle God. saving is a hobby. Are we going to bite her? <gasps> oh, oh, she put it in uh, not world. only is that not the way to save anything, but what's right. even worse, that wasn't a turtle. And by the way, that turtle was actually a tortoise. And tortoises can't swim. Yeah, you can only imagine the kind of hate this girl received after right. she sent that snap. Not only did she throw a tortoise that can't swim into water, she threw it from very high up, and then she said that she was a savior. <laughs> did you not know that tortoises don't swim? Did I did not know that. She thought I never intended anyone to think that I killed an animal or I would ever do anything to harm an animal. Yeah, she was trying to save it. Yeah, yeah, she thought she was doing good. So this kind of does have a happy ending. Kind of. Do you think the tortoise survived? Yes, it did survive. He popped up out of the water and walked into the woods. Either way, <laughs> I would probably regret sending that snap every single day. Okay, now we're going to talk about something the that truth. is very, right. very sad and very real. And that is people that get into car accidents because of Snapchat. Now, car accidents have obviously been around Ooh. forever, but now, because everybody has a smartphone in their hands at all times, it's Car accidents are deep. Worse. Yeah, they're so dangerous. You never be on your phone while you're driving, never. Philadelphia. And it's not you, it's other people around you, for real. burning alive in their wrecked car. Now, before they died, they were all Snapchat. Posting a crazy night. While they were having fun and snapping and driving, their car crashed into a tractor trailer. Now, this mm. tractor trailer was carrying large amounts of herbicide, and that is highly flammable. Oh the car my. burst into flames instantly, and everybody inside died. Now, nobody knew why they were driving so fast. Some people thought they were trying to get away from oh something. People thought there was more to this story. Well, then a few weeks later, this is actually kind of like sad. The girls were snaps. trying to get their speed right, as high as they like could. So they put on the speed filter on Snapchat and impress their friends. Now, this happens all the time. People trying to go faster so they get their speed filter higher and yeah, they can send it to their friends and say, oh, I'm going so much faster right, than you. Right. Well, in one case, it even landed somebody in prison. A man named Adil was arrested after a car accident in 2014 that left another driver dead. Now, just oh, before man. the accident, he sent a snap to his friend that said, Leads to Rochdale, 11 minutes, catch me. And then he crashed and killed somebody. Now, obviously, Damn. snapping and bragging about how fast you're going is awful. But what's even worse is bragging about how drunk you are while you're driving. Ooh. Earlier this year, three women died because of a car accident from snapping and drinking and driving. Oh they posted goodness. a series of snaps of themselves drinking an like entire bottle of vodka while them. they were driving. Now, this is something that happens all too often, and the police are trying to stop it. Yeah. This was a uh, very tragic accident, and it serves as an example of what can happen when you mix alcohol and driving in a vehicle. Now listen, we talked about this in the Instagram video I did, and we're going to talk about it again. Don't drink and drive. And definitely, don't drink and snap and drive. That's right. you distractions, have... and you might end up dead. Why are you okay. acting for We're going to talk about something that I am so fascinated by. Now because everybody's snapping all the time, you might catch something unexpected. You might even catch your murder. In 2017, two teenage girls were found dead in the woods near mm. an Indiana hiking trail. Now, before they died, one of the girls might have gotten audio and video and pictures of their murder. Now, right. listen, this story breaks my heart, but I want to talk about it for a reason. First, let me give you some more details wow. about Liberty and Abigail. Now, these were just two normal teenage girls exploring nature. Just right. hours after their family dropped them off by some old railroad tracks, the girls' bodies 
found. Now the killer is not That's crazy. Away, but Liberty apparently I can't imagine. And uploaded videos of a man authorities now consider one of their main suspects. She even recorded some audio of the man. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Now the case is still ongoing and they were very brave Damn. to start Snapchatting the second they felt like something was going to happen. But remember, mm -hmm. in moments like this, please also call 911. Right. Hopefully soon we will find out who killed Liberty and Abigail. All right, wow, now let's talk sad. about some paranormal stuff. Now many people believe paranormal. that they have caught ghosts. I hate ghosts. paranormal so, stuff. Right. I'm sure you've seen this before. People that's try what, that's to what I don't like. That's what I don't like. Face filter, but then something behind them picks it up. Now obviously that could just be a glitch, or it could be Snapchat seeing something that we don't. No right. touch you, okay? Can I touch you? Oh, because the face is recognizing Can the face. Yeah, super mm -hmm. creepy. There and are tons moving, of snaps out there moving. of people who've been trying to do the face swap and it literally swaps with something in the darkness behind them. Or literally, like, it'll detect yes, it. Yes, I can't watch this. The hallway. Sometimes it'll you seen the eyes? Yeah. But that's the eye from the filter. There's nobody there. So is it a glitch? Or is it actually seeing a, person. a face? Now, obviously, some of them just look like glitches. Bruh. But this next you video... <laughs> now, this woman was playing with a dog filter. And then another dog appeared next to her. Now, she jokingly said, stick your tongue out. And then this happened. Okay, so I'm on the side of the malfaiteur. It's my friend. Can you take it away, please? But if you do that... Ah! Ah! She literally jokingly says, stick your tongue out. And then it happens. Look at her face. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. You know what? Wait. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay. I'm about to try I it. I want to go to that haunted room. Go in my house try it upstairs. Try this mm -hmm. myself. Actually, no, I don't. <laughs> no, you know what? No, let's do it. Let's go find some ghosts. Okay. You see, I'm going to do it. Room. I'm going to go oh my God, the I'm so scared. The noises and try a face filter. Huh? <laughs> like you. Oh, my God. I'm so scared. <laughs> That's how I would be like, no. No, okay. <laughs> okay, what if I just face it this way? Okay. In the closet, I don't see anything. You must be. <laughs> so, that was the scariest snapchats ever and if you all want to see that whole video we will link the video in the description box below so go check that out but yeah these seem like more of like the saddest ones i mean he started getting to the scary ones but yeah, i can't yeah, even I watch, watch because too. like she over here screaming. screaming no she was over here screaming and i know you guys seen that and we just can't have her you know going to the er tonight so we're just gonna end it here all right, thank you all for checking out that video with us. Please do not forget to check out the description box below for our social media as well as the key to YouTube channel. And we'll see you on our next video. Bye.